soldiers and airmen? No, we treated all the soldiers. Oh, you did? Yes. Oh, I didn't realize that. Yes, yeah, so we well, were called nigger many a time. And don't put your hands on me, nigger. And I won't take that blood, nigger. But uh, you just kept on going. Were there any white soldiers that treated you halfway decently? Oh, yes. There were a lot of them. There were a lot of them. How many patients would you estimate were at Nichols General Hospital mm. during that period? Oh, 500 or more. I'm just estimating because I really don't know. So there'd be the 30 black nurses and approximately how many white nurses? Oh, over 100 or more. So you were all mixed in together? We were all mixed if together. You, if a white nurse and then a black nurse would you know, have certain responsibilities, yes. say, on the same ward? Yeah, we do the same things. We, uh, and one time I almost got to be a head nurse on one of the units of the paraplegics, but uh, I couldn't handle it because uh, when I went up for orientation, um, they gave me the dressings to do for that morning. So I... Uh, started with my little cart down the ward and they had so many pressure sores and so many problems that you had to deal with that I was kind of slow my first day and I guess it must have been almost lunchtime when I got to one soldier and then he sounded off don't put your hands on me nigger and it, it bothered me to the point where I just left everything and went up and talked to the head nurse and she said, oh, don't pay any attention to him. But he continued and they sent him to the guardhouse in bed and all. <laughs> and they brought him back and he still said, nigger, it didn't make any difference. He couldn't move, but he didn't want me to touch him. And I said, I don't think I, I'll fit in up here very well. I think I'd like to go back to my medical surgical unit and so they let me go back of the 500 patients how many uh, black soldiers were in the barracks if, if any very little very few very few I remember on the surgical unit where I was working I might have had two or three blacks do you yeah. remember what units they were from no. If at all. No. I know there's the 92nd Division was one all-black division. No. But uh, no, no. There were a lot of uh, prisoners of war down there at Nichols General Hospital from Germany. In Camp McCoy, they were from Korea and Japan. We had no, we took care of them, but they never talked to us. The Koreans were real nice, though. They're friendly. They always grinned at you and uh, gave you little pictures that they painted. They were good at, in art. Hmm. But down in uh, Nichols, the majority of the uh, patients were uh, Germans and, and Americans.